Soldiers in Humvees halt on a plane near Afghanistan's border with Pakistan. They stop trucks and check the driver's personal belongings. Local trucks are often pressed into service by the Taliban. They're, they're locals, but um, sometimes the Taliban pays them to transport stuff from here back to the enemy. The soldier's FOB, or forward operating base, is only five kilometers away. The soldiers find a manual for a high-powered radio in one truck and detain the driver. The radio could be used to trigger roadside bombs, also called IEDs. It looks pretty suspicious. They also had a book um, of a radio, high-powered radio, but it wasn't in the truck, and they thought it was a truck manual, so the whole thing doesn't really make sense, so we called higher, and they made a decision we'll probably uh, end up bringing these guys in. Soldiers say they have never been attacked when working a temporary checkpoint like this, but they have to stay alert. Uh, it's not too bad doing a VCP unless a uh, you know, vehicle-borne IED rolls up or something like that. Or these guys end up trying to rocket us from the, you know, the ridge line or something. But other than that, you know, it's pretty calm. This unit has been here six months and soldiers say this is a steady routine. Despite that, it can be exciting. I'm still hyped up by it. You know, I, I find it exciting. I like it. I like it a lot, but um, I don't know. Maybe after a while it might start getting to me, but as of right now, I still I enjoy it. Soldiers check this road one time a week or more. It's about nine miles to the border with Pakistan back there. Soldiers say there's plenty of routes into the country, but every little bit helps. Near forward operating base Bermel, Doug Grindle for CBS 5 News.